Hey guys, welcome to the Entrepreneur Show, episode 14. We got a lot of things to talk about, but right now I'm going to introduce a special guest for you guys, alright? It's not P. Diddy, it's someone better than that. Are you ready? Barack Obama, you guys. Barack Obama. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank Holler you. at your boy. Holler <laughs> at your boy. Anyways, thank you, Richard. Uh, oh, thank you for coming to the show, man. Yes. This, what, what show is this again? Uh, well, this is Entrepreneur Show, as you see on the bottom here. Uh, we talk about how to start your own business for young entrepreneurs. That's uh, very interesting. Very interesting. And uh, what do we have planned for today? Uh, we got a lot of things to talk about. First, we got the weekly update where uh, Eman will talk about the stock market and the number one movie. Then oh, uh, who's this uh, Eman character? Some loser. I, I, I don't like the guy. Well, I hear, crazy. I've heard good things about him. Yeah, okay. Maybe a sectional champ, something like that. <laughs> Anyways, we got, we got Ask the Russian. Uh, yeah, some guy from Russia. He talks about how to start business and all that good stuff so all oh, those russians sarah palin sees them all the time <laughs> and after that our main topic is how to start your own radio station using little to no money and the music of the day is swagger like us because of you because you have swagger barack obama you got the ultimate oh, swagger oh, oh. well i know about the swag so mr west is in the building swagger on a hundred thousand trillion Hey yo, I know I got it first. I'm Christopher Columbus. Y'all just a pill, bros. Thanksgiving, do we even got a question? Hermes Pastel, I pass. Right, what's up, young entrepreneurs? E Man here. Just wearing my nice leather jacket. You know, it's like the X Men 2 movie. I like it, you know. Remember those costumes, they were sick. Anyway, we got the weekly update. And the Dow Jones is down negative 82.35 points, bringing it at a current value of 70,050.41 points. The NASDAQ is down negative 7.35 points, bringing at current value of 1,534.36 points. And also, the current news is Congress passes the stimulus bills. So, we'll see how that turns out. Hopefully it turns out for the better. And the number one movie is Friday the 13th, bringing in $42 million. That's your weekly update, and stay tuned. Hello, friends. So... I was talking to my friend Vasya the other day. He said to me, Todd, listen, you talk about business and show. I said, no, Vasya, I talk about business, not business, business. What? <laughs> Anyways, so my friends, this is Ask the Russian segment on entrepreneurshow.com on YouTube. Thanks. So, today I talk about the economic stimulus package. What is it and what it does? Alright, so um, the way I look at it, so this little boy he gets thirsty, he's playing outside all day. He's sweating, his stomach hurts, he's thirsty. So <clears throat> he goes home and his mom, his mom being the garment, says, Alright, you're thirsty. So gets a huge fireman hose, right? Sticks in his mouth and is chugging at it, chugging. And he's getting filled with water. And the water is being the... And the water is being the, uh... Money that the government is trying to pump in to the economy, which is the little boy who's thirsty. Alright? So what happens to the little boy? His stomach hurts, he pukes, he has to go to the bathroom. And oh, God, it's horrible. Oh, it's a mess everywhere. It's bad news. It's nice to change his pants. That's gross. But... Is the mother doing a good thing by pumping all that water into the little boy? Because it's a little boy, for God's sake. You don't, you don't, you don't do that to a little boy. That's awful. Oh, my question for you is, is, is Obama doing right now smart or stupid? And I want to I'm gonna bring up this special point that I thought of. You may not agree with me, but this is my editorial. The government owns the banks. The banks own the people. So, wouldn't the government own the people? Just think about that. I want I want to go on next week and I'll talk more about this, but I just had the idea and I want to see what you guys think about that. All right? Thank you very much. I, I really appreciate your views. Thank you. So, next weekend you'll watch our show. It'll be glass. Oh, I, mm, very nice. Okay. Slow team. I love you. Mwah. For everybody, tune in next week. Thanks. What's up all my young entrepreneurs, we got a new topic, it's how to start your own radio station. 
and it's free and the only thing you need is a phone and a computer. Alright, so the first step is to go to blogtalkradio.com and there you go to registration. You'll create your display name, username and password, etc. Then click on I want to host my own show. Alright, the second part of the process is editing your profile. When you edit your profile, you got to make a logo, tell the name of your show, and give a description of the show. And then also, you'll be given two phone numbers, a host and a guest, so you'll need your cell phone. And Richard Thomas the third step is. And the, th the third step is adding an episode. Um, the way you add an episode is by writing a title, for example, The Entrepreneur Show. Then you put tags. Uh, also, after you put tags, you have to write a description about the show, what you're going to talk about. The most important part is the duration of the time, and that's telling you what time you're going to put the show, how long it is going to be, what the date, and when does it end. After you do this step, it's the final step. Alright, and the final step is calling the number that Blog Talk Radio gave you to start the show. And if you're still confused, check on the link on the side. There's a video on how to register on Blog Talk Radio. Alright, now it's time for the closing. Hi guys, hope you guys enjoyed the Entrepreneur Show episode 14 with our special guest, Barack Obama. Yes. And next week we will talk about the stimulus package. A little preview of the stimulus package is uh, $789 billion spent on the United States citizens and the improvement of our country. Some highlights include $4 billion to Social Security, $54 billion to go to our schools, $70 billion to spare 24 million taxpayers from being hit with the alternative minimum tax in 2009, and $46 billion to transportation. There's many other things that we have spent money on, but those are some of the highlights. We will be talking about that next week on The Entrepreneur Show. Yep. We have a whole category on the recession and Barack Obama's stimulus package. Yes, sir. you have any last words to close it? Well, keep it real. Peace out. That's awful. Um, so my question for you, ladies and gentlemen, oh. viewers, shh, Josh, <laughs> I'm doing something. Anyway, 